What's up, guys? It's your boy, Cliff J. And your girl, Tofu. Yeah! yeah. Alright, we're going into Dr. Stone episode number 17, 100 Nights and a Thousand Skies. So I guess we're going to be hearing more about the past of what had happened and oh, what yeah. the dad built this up or all of that jazz. <laughs> I don't know. Civilization 1. Yes. Civilization 5, 6. Start of a game. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> she actually wore a lucky ramen shirt today. Ramen. For Dr. Stone. Ramen. Who doesn't love ramen? I know, we love ramen. Ramen, oh, it's the best. It's divine. Too bad that guy didn't get to in fully enjoy it because he saw the world get turned into stone. Oh yeah, that's right. He couldn't enjoy the ramen, but too bad the, st the, the world got to stone, so yeah. it kind of ruined it. Ruined his first ramen experience. Yes. Are you guys ready to jump into episode number 17? Yes, we are. All right, let's go ahead and start the show. Woo! Man, I wonder what that is, though. Looks like a sun, but dull. <laughs> kind of looks like a monster energy. Yeah, monster energy. <laughs> yeah, that's right. They could still, they're still conscious. I love how he just never panics and he's always logical yeah. about everything. Man, if I got stuck in that stone, I think I would go crazy. <laughs> yeah, I go crazy too. I'd be like, what? What? Yes! It all started from the dad. Yes. Damn! But because the dad learned from the son. That's true, right? Yes. Yeah, that is true. And it's because of Senku, he was able to survive to be able to come back down. Yeah, because he wouldn't have gone up to space if it wasn't for Senku. No. So it, technically, it is all started by Senku. Yes! But his dad, his dad is continuing it for him. Yeah. Continuing civilization. But yeah, going back to being stuck in my head for a thousand years, I would go crazy. I'm surprised these guys didn't snap out of it and be crazy. Like, talking to themselves so much. Yeah. Oh. What? What? Oh, they're saying he has to stay? Oh, he oh. wants. He's gonna go. So his dad didn't come down to Earth. No. But they're in the middle of nowhere. Yes. Oh no. Oh no, they're in trouble. Man, the way uh, him and his son both think. Yeah, they think the same. <laughs> How many statues do we need to pickpocket? <laughs> I'll swim the whole way. Yeah, remember this guy can swim too. Stop talking to man. <laughs> well, he's got to let him know. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> She's singing now. Wait. Oh, oh! They came! Yeah! Oh, wow. dad. Nice. Wow, 10 hours upside down. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Dun, da, da, da. Man, do you actually think they survive? Whoa. Oh, there's somebody. Oh, no, uh, it's stoned. That guy looks familiar. No, but the, the it reached all the way down here. Everybody's, yeah. Yeah, it's the whole planet. Well, I mean, with them being the last survivors, if they go to a city, they're, you know, they're good. They're good, yeah. They've got everything they want or need. Dude, Sukasa should be a descendant of her. <laughs> oh yeah, no, nah, never mind. I'm just joking. I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's Sukasa's. It was a, it was a joke. Oh, uh, this kid. So, oh, this woman had two. I had a feeling this. Why yeah, does he not on. look at me? He's like, crap. 
¿Quién, quién, quién lo? Because they already made their couple, so they have to be a couple. Well, in this day, in this post-apocalyptic world, at least they got an entertainer. Yeah. Oh, she had an alcoholic oh. dad. Oh, he beat her up. That's what those bandages are That's what are the for. bandages was, right? There's still hope because the sun is out there still. Yes. Isn't that crazy, man? Three years later, even all this, he doesn't lose hope for his son. No. Yeah, passing on to the next generation! Yes! Wow! Oh. All of these generations? Yeah! All leads down to them! Wow. And bam! Boom! Senku is born! Yep! Again! <laughs> Yes! yes! Oh my yes! god! Now they're, it's clicking! Oh yeah! So they're not blood related. Oh, well, kind yeah, of. But, yeah. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Drink <Whoa. up>, crow. <laughs> it's almost like the village is celebrating for Senku. Oh yeah. You know? Well, I mean they are, but you know, the actual, what, what it was meant for. Yes. Everybody's getting drunk. No, oh. <laughs> dude. Wow, rule is a rule, remember? Yes. Oh, here he gets to go over the bridge. Senku's going somewhere with Ruri? Oh, he already knew his dad had a message for him. Oh no, she's getting sick too. Oh wait, no, this is back Th in the this past. This is back in time. Oh no. Oh, oh, Connie died. I don't think they came back either. Oh no. Oh wow. Oh no, he's getting sick too. And it's pneumonia. Oh, thanks to Senku's dad. Oh, the ramen! <laughs> oh. Oh. Humanity will make it back to the point where we'll be eating ramen again. Wait. He, oh, he died. All the space stuff destroyed. Yeah. Look at all these kids. Oh, so they, he's been speaking English to her this whole time. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, oh, it's from the intro, right? Wow, 3,700 years ago. Oh, it's his dad that said this. Yeah. Oh, oh that's his tombstone, right? Yeah. Because the kids made it, so it wasn't it wasn't good. No. The, the kids made it. Wow, his dad went through a lot. Mm -hmm. 
Oh. That's nice. Wow. Positive way of looking at it. All right. <laughs> He's only like I drink cola. I don't want. I don't want of that alcohol stuff. <laughs> They're coming. Oh no! What? Oh my gosh! Wait. Oh, dude, Sukasa and his army is just, they're they're on the attack. Yeah. Oh man. Uh oh. Well, are they this even ready is... for it? Oh, well, they got it. They're drinking. Yeah, they're drinking. They gotta get ready like real quick. <laughs> yeah. That's so funny. Gan is just hanging out, and then he's like, "Oh, they're already. They're on the yeah, attack. They're... they're on their way here now." Yeah, dude. What the hell, Gan? They're coming. Get out of here, again. Yeah. You're not allowed here, again. This just proves how humanity is just meant to stay on Earth. Is that the Earth or whatever the natural phenomenon was that caused the stone? Mm -hmm. Try to eliminate humans. Yes. It, basically, maybe whatever this phenomenon is is trying to destroy because humans are being parasite of the earth or destroying the earth, so it, the earth is fighting back. Oh yeah, maybe like some science natural disaster. Yeah, that's so just there's no name for it. Some kind of natural uh, disaster. The earth just giving back to the humans. But the thing is, it's like even though no matter what, humans will always keep going. Yes. Because what's the chance? That the father of the brilliant mind, Senku, mm -hmm. was the one that went up to space, has the same kind of mind together that they, they both just don't give up. Yes. He comes back down, starts the village, knowing that his son will save the humanity. It just shows like humans are just meant for the prosper and Earth. Right? Um. Well, I, I mean. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I... <laughs> I don't think they're trying to go that deep. Oh, really? Am I yeah. going too deep? Well, I don't know. Maybe they are, but... Yeah. Um, but it's just... It's crazy because, you know... Yeah. I, I don't know. Maybe maybe that's too... that Maybe that's a little bit too deep. All right. Fine. My <laughs> bad. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. But it's just like... It's, it's crazy how it's just destiny. It's just... Yeah. It was destiny for them. <clears throat> it was fate that those two came together. It's a reason that mm -hmm. you can't take down humanity. Yeah. You can't take down humanity because look, Senku got out. He's the one that's going to save humanity. He mm -hmm. has all the history in his head. I don't know. Maybe I'm going too deep, yeah. No, I mean it was all meant to be and it was it happened. Mm -hmm. And uh thank God for that because now he knows where his dad is and he can say that his dad lived his life and his dad is the reason that helps him to move on and survive. Right. What's going on right now? Because I feel like the whatever the stone is, it's not an attack. It's not an attack from the aliens. It's not an attack from humans. No. It's a natural disaster. It's not something natural. So yeah. it's like almost like Mother Nature is fighting back. Yeah, like something science fiction. Yeah, Mother Nature fought back. And it's basically telling the humans, here's a second chance. Or like start all over, but in the right way or something. I don't know. Yeah, I guess. I don't know. I, it's just like, you know, how a volcano erupts and everybody goes in extinct, except maybe like the alligators and stuff. They're the little special guys that survived. Right, right, it's right. It's like the same thing. There's those special guys that survived up in space and then they came back down <laughs> and they tried to repopulate uh, and it succeeded. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, there's a lot of deaths that mm -hmm. happen. Those yeah. kids... You know, they had to grow up on their own without parents. Yeah, that's right. So the tombstone, the reason why it looked like that was because the kids made it. Yes. Yeah. And he was the last one to go. Yeah. And the, it's, it's surprising that the kids at such a young age are able to pass the story down correctly. Like, yeah. Yeah, I, I thought it was going to be the telephone game where things get twisted. I mean, it, it did come out as now he's like a mythology. Yes. You know, like some kind of hundred tales. But it's passed down correctly. To Senko and the dad got the message to him. Yes, he did. And they were able to have the stones or whatever. Someone took interest, which was Chrome. Mm -hmm. And now Senku. Yeah, but Sukasa is here to destroy all of that. Yeah, Sukasa is here to destroy that. Wow. And dude, I'm not me. I swear I haven't watched these episodes. <laughs> like everything I keep saying. Like, oh, <laughs> yeah. that's, that's what's happening. Yeah, he. But, I'm so glad he brought back. The ramen. the ramen. We yeah. were even just talking about the last one. We're just like, dude, he the they ruined this experience for the ramen. But right before he dies, he's just like, dude, that ramen was freaking badass. 
Yeah, it was good. Yeah, he waited till in his deathbed to tell him that. It's like, dang, that was good. Yeah. Made, made his uh, dad cry, too. One by one died, and uh, uh, generations after generations leads to this, and which is the savior, because, yeah. Yeah. Which is the savior, Senku. Yeah, he's the savior. Seven billion people he's going to save. Yes. Yeah. And it's sad, though, because they tried to make it to the mainland Japan, and they couldn't. Yeah, they couldn't. They so, stayed in the island. Yeah, they were stuck on the island. Yeah. How is Senku going to save 7 billion people? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> right? Yeah. I mean, it's not like he can magically just make a huge explosion explosion around the earth. and. Yeah, and even if he did, everybody would go crazy. Maybe it's just like a reminder. Yes. Of what will happen if you keep going again like that. If no, humanity, yeah, I, I don't okay. think that's what this is about. Okay. Yeah, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what I do don't you, know. You go ahead. Tell me. Okay, you tell us your theory. No, my no, my thing is it's just it's a second chance for humans. We're destroying Earth, and Earth was mad uh, by sucking out the planet Earth. So it petrified all human beings. Why Why are animals still alive? I mean, besides the birds, but why are, why are the animals still alive? Don't, I don't know. Because they don't take too much like humans do. True. And maybe it's slowly killing Earth. And that's why the Earth fought back. Since it fought back, it's basically whoever's up was in the ISS came back down. It's just humanity's second chance. And it's just a reminder saying, no, nah, it just doesn't make sense. I'm sorry. It's okay. Yeah. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just like, I guess, yeah, I'm sorry. My bad. The reason why I got this was because I was watching Final Fantasy VII Advent Children. I don't know if you guys watched that movie, but I watched it a lot of times. And for some reason, we decided to watch Final Fantasy Advent Children the other day. And that's the part of the story of Advent Children. I mean, a lot of you guys might know the story of Final Fantasy VII. But um, I guess that's where I'm just implying that to here. I'm comparing that to this one, which is... Oh. Yeah, that's where... Uh, that's why I'm just saying that. Ah. Yeah, that's that's what I was getting at. But ah, uh, never mind. Yeah. Yeah, whatever. Sorry, guys. Yeah, whatever. But okay. Anyways, yeah. Well, all right, you guys. Next episode is going to be us getting our scientific machines and weapons yeah. to take down Tsukasa and be ready war. for this war. It's war time. Yeah, and yeah. hopefully we meet back up with Yuzuhira and... Um, Taijo, what the hell? When are we going to be seeing them? Yeah. What if they find out, like, yo, we got a lot of things to tell you. Do you know that this village is after Senku's dad? <laughs> Senku? Yeah, if Senku is meant to rule this world. <laughs> no. Can you imagine Taijo Yuzuhira comes back and Senku, Senku, oh, it's been a long time, we missed you, how's it been? Ah, nothing, I'm the chief of this village now. And this what? is all my family. <laughs> and these are all my family. They're like, what? Wait, what the hell just happened? Yeah. I'm the ancestor to these guys. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I can't wait to see Taijo and uh, Yuzira come, come back and hear the story. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and going back. None of those people in that village was turned into stone. They're all people that just came from generation to generation. It's all generations. From the, the people in space. Oh, yeah. Uh, remember, we're like, what if the dad was purposely put Senku? Oh, yeah. Yeah, but it was just, he just left it alone. But it was part of it, though. He believed in his son. He, he believed in his son. So not technically, he knew that how long, he didn't calculate that uh, he was going to snap out of it. But And he never found him. He never found him. But, but he just believed in him. He believed in him, and that's why he came back and he gave him friends. Yes. That will push him through to get this work done. Yes. Yeah. Maybe uh, his dad got reincarnated into that acid to go and drip onto Senku. <laughs> Come on, Senku, 3,700 years. I'm going to drop on you <laughs> so nah. that you can go and see the village I created and made for you. <laughs> you see, now we're both going crazy on this on, on this anime now. Now we're, now we're both losing our head. That time I got reincarnated as acid. <laughs> oh, God, dude. Yeah, we're losing our head, guys. So there you go. Um, that was... Dr. Stone, thank you guys so much for joining us. We'll see you guys soon for Dr. Stone, episode number 17. Till then, have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.